Hey everybody, welcome back to Akimia Vampire. Right now in front of Shakespeare's home. And Shakespeare Villa was some distance from the mansion, but Lee Comte was uh, wasted no time in heading there. Child uh, Comte, and uh, tis a rare pleasure to see you here at such late hour. I pray you come inside, the night wind is most chill. Hey, what's up? If you will, um, a bus set, I will prepare some tea or may mayhap a wine would suit your uh, palate better. Um, by good fortune, I perceive a most uh, delectable uh, plan just last week. I shall. I don't need tea, well, or a wine. Give me beer. <laughs> <laughs> I will be leaving ag um, again as soon as you've answered my questions. The Comte is my remain uh, graceful and as soon as he slowly closed the distance between the two of them. He didn't stop until the toes of their um, shoes were almost touching and his voice remained calm and culture died. He went on. You know that Gilles de Reyes has been reborn in this time, don't you? I? There, let me, uh, let me, um, change my... S Question, I, th this is the perfect voice for him. Well, who is the shadow um, hiding in the wings? The thing done smile faded from Shakespeare's lips, something tightened in, in expression, but he said nothing. There are only two people in this world who can see doing this. Myself and an old friend of mine, but we went our separate ways and I have seen him in centuries. Oh, wait! Hold on! Who is it? Shakespeare touched his hair slightly, but his mismatched gaze never waved from the country's golden eyes. Okay. S sorry, in my head, I was thinking of Leonardo da Vinci, but nah, he's still in the mansion. Because I remember the detail where, uh, Frick, um, well, Leonardo, Leonardo gave the diary to Mozart, and Mozart gave it to us. Jean left it in the library, so Leonardo went in the library, um, probably, I believe, I guess, <laughs> um, found the diary, so gave it to Mozart, and Mozart gave it to us, so it cannot be Leonardo. Shakespeare said, okay, slightly. If you have decided, um, and decide to ally with him, and uh, they would explain everything that's going on. Shakespeare remained silent, and a faint spark of anger flared into um, life deep in the Conti's gaze. Answer me well. Um, how will my answer help you? A friend of yours can be not by an eternal his life stretching out of time immortal, immortal, or would this internal fight internal and immortal death match? I don't want, but I'm doing it. Uh, when uh, shall we see meet again? Oh no, wait, what? Sorry, I, I could be reading it wrong. This is like a Macbeth, um, Shakespeare thing. Uh, where shall we, uh, the um, three meet again in thunder, lightning, or in rain? Se um, second wedding, and all that. When the hurly burly's done, um, when the battle's lost and won, fair and foul, um, fair is foul, and foul is fair. Uh, what blind man is that? <laughs> uh, shall the dwelling with peak and pine, the wee sisters hand in hand, uh, posters of the sea and land, thus to go about, about um, what are these? Uh, okay, I rem, uh, I have not read the whole Shakespeare book thing. We only like, um, uh, read about the frick. We we definitely write about um about the witches, about the witches. We did write about um Macbeth, uh, Lady Macbeth. Uh, we did. Oh wait, first, 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 first. Um, oh, it's something about a fog and misty air or something like that. Sorry. It's been a while. It's been like what a year now. Damn, or have we eaten? Okay. Oh, damn. No, we did write about Mac uh, Lady Macbeth and when she gone crazy. 
We didn't write about uh, we did write, write about uh Ma Macbeth went insane because uh, he saw the ghost which he killed and everyone did everyone hasn't like everyone didn't see the ghost. So they were worried. Oh damn. I'm just reading through to see if I remember anything. What's uh uh, what is the terror fight and turn on mortal death match? Uh, well, let's see. Uh, come without come may. No, nothing in this life becomes him like the living and the die. I don't think I know. There's no art. And yet, to fear of my nature is to fill of the milk and human kindness. Come, you spirits, the tent of the mortals, unsex me here. <gasps> Wait, I fill me from the crown to the toe. Ooh. Oh, when is that? Oh, God. I think I think I heard that. Okay, go into my woman's and take my milk for gal, you mur uh, mur minister. Okay, yeah, I, rem I read... Yeah, definitely read about that part. Definitely. The hemp's band smell wouldn't know. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm off to um topic. Yeah. And ah uh, dear, or uh, with this internal fire, um, internal and immortal death match. Shakespeare's lips curved upward just slightly, his softer laughter cutting through the tense silence. I do, I do admit I will find such a sight fascinating. They come to a move suddenly, reach, um, reaching up and wrapped his arms around, um, Shakespeare's throat. <gasps> oh, he's gonna kill him. Shakespeare froze, making a struggle, gasping sound as he stared into Lee, um, Lee Comte's eyes. His unusual judgment uh, has vanished, and, will, and what remains in those golden depths will strike fear into the heart of the bravest man. Bravest man. Uh, what flicker in his eyes, whispering an eternal already seen, and then, in turn, yet to come, and Shakespeare began to tremble. I will not uh, force uh, the truth from you. But you will do well to remember this. If you ever do anything like this again, I will, uh, I'll be coming to inflict punishment on all of you. I will chase you to the very depths of hell and make no mistake, I will not stop until there is nothing left of you uh, but dust. Jesus. Do not accept, um, expect me to turn a blind eye to anyone who dares to hurt those who share my home and hospitality. The long fingers uh, wrapped around Shakespeare's now moved gently away. Shakespeare allowed a sun ra a rasping breath and then another. Well, it seems I have overstayed my welcome. I want to know the name, so I really want to Google it. <laughs> I will take my leave. Don't slam suddenly a shot to leave Shakespeare alone and, sh and shaking in the middle of the room. <laughs> It's not a bed of roses, but rather a bed of thorns I have laid for myself. Yet, tis all brought to him by my mind own desires. Shakespeare's um, gaze low to his uh, trembled hands, and in his mind he heard an echo of words he once spoken to Jean. It's in his ascent, and here's uh, be no oblusion without punishment. Rebirth does not um, wash away the sins of the past. It's soon as a sing, and there's no absolution without punishment. Never have uh, words more suited for me. What punishment might await me beyond my pursuit of semblant charges? For a moment, the smile on his lips seemed painfully sorrowful, and then he was gone, and a usual smile returned. But there be no turning back now, and none was allowed such a choice. It being um, gagged and blindfolded, and I had no idea. How much time had passed since I'd been taken from the mansion? How about I remove that blindfold, mademoiselle? Okay. Now where we are. Uh, now are we... Wait. And now where are we? Where the girl is taking me and that's... Uh, what's wrong with her? I bet you were expecting to be kidnapped twice in one day. In one day? Jesus! And by the same man both times. Ah, uh, change chapter 22. I've been gagged and blindfolded, and I had no idea how much time had passed since I've been taken from the mansion. How about I remove that blindfold, mademoiselle? 
and I want to see the rest of the class and so I can see again and breath properly again. Oh! Hello! Oh. I don't know. So right now I was looking. Okay. Okay, great, hey, great. Now where are we? Uh, well, we're at a place. I looked around quickly at the place was the family I thought, and I had no idea which way we'd come from or how far. Actually, that's actually kind of scary. Let's just say you got kidnapped and they take you to a place somewhere you're not unfamiliar with. That's just scary right there. Alright. Uh, uh, in the distance, I could see the ocean, but it was the graves that surrounded me on the all sides. Um, all sides, uh, all sides that caught my attention. Gilles says to miss them, and I watched where I see and patted his sh horse's uh, rump, uh, shown it away, and then turned to face me. Yeah, I thought this was meant to be over. I still can't believe you're uh, doing this. I've been quietly, um, quietly drinking the tea, as Bash had, um, had me from. Uh, for me, when all of a sudden I heard the crash of breaking glass. Everything after that had happened too fast, so fast that I was still struggling to process it. Musa had hurried in, principally uh, drawn by the uh, noises, and Gilas had drawn his sword and sent him flying at once. Oof! Musa! Oh no! <laughs> I barely had no time to recover his shock to groan or the blood that cover his um 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 hand um arm and hand. You're pathetic. I'm taking in the woman. <laughs> I know he'll come and find me again if she's gone. Isn't that right, Jean? I bet you um you weren't expecting to be kidnapped twice in one day and by the same man bo um both twice. Isn't this something? <laughs> His laughter had a twisted edge to it, and the sound sound just shivered down my spine. Something's wrong. No, I mean really, really wrong. When he'd um, confronted Jane earlier that e that evening, he'd been uh, overly zealous, but he still seemed uh, human in a way. But that sense of humanity has gone. Now he seemed empty of life, empty of reason, like a figure going through the motion motions. The light, the light in his eyes was gone, and his uh, roving gaze uh, refused to focus uh, focus on um. Single thing, even me. Why are we here? What are you planning to do this time? Isn't it obvious? I'm going to kill you on the way here for Jim to come for you. <laughs> I've lost my mind, they're going completely blank for a moment. Damn. <laughs> Oof. Oh, wait, you brought me here to kill me? Oh no, that's so cringy. <laughs> Gives his gaze, um, says, get there around, never again, um, get, um, standing on anything, but that only made his, uh, words scarier somehow. Without thinking, I took a step back, and that made me realize that he hadn't uh, bothered to tie me up this time. So, let's just say we are perfect athlete. We got our sneakers on, and we can run faster than a horse. We got that <laughs> Because I'm not big this time, so there's no time right. Alright, once you kill me, I'm dead. Okay. Um deep breaths, focus. <gasps> and fall backwards to the ocean. <laughs> if I can't die here. I made all those promises to Jin. And if I die here, that that is for him. He'll kill girls and then he'll be lost in the darkness for good. He'll shut himself off completely and join in despair until he finds a way to die. Yeah, that's what we call this mansion roof. <laughs> no, I'm joking. That scared me for more than dying dead, and it also gave me the courage I needed to push aside my fear. Do you think uh, Jim will take your hand if you kill me? Do you think he'll follow you then? Of course he will. He's got such a gun to heart. That boy he worries about you. That's why he can't bring himself to leave. So I just need to get rid of you. So, um, uh, if you're so, so that kill me will help, then go ahead and kill me. Oh, you're offering now? Okay, 
kidding. <laughs> I am, but only um so long as you understand this. If you kill me, Jean will never um、uh, ever take your hand. <laughs> Is that so? <laughs> Is it? Jean didn't refuse your offer because he doesn't trust you, and he definitely wasn't tr-、uh, trying to make a choice between you and I. Okay, then why did he refuse? Well, then I thought of the diary Jean had written, the halting words that filled page from page. I thought of Jean's soft, gentle laughter, a rare sound, but all the more precious than you. I chose to share it with me. I thought of this、um, his beautiful face bathed in the light of the sun and the happiness in his smile as he met each other's gaze. I know why Jean didn't take her hand because he started to want to live again. Don't be ridiculous. Well, that、yeah, can't be true. You <laughs> know, it went so as good as the fears, but、um, but I can admit those quiet Solomon、uh, uh, gravestones. Gene wants to stand up on that、uh, platform and meet his death to, in in those in those flames. Such his only wish. Hellfire, hellfire, in my in. Uh, why does it remind me of the Hunchback of Notre Dame? Um, Hellfire. Uh, how dare you uh, say the prayer is out、uh, with your、um, wishful thinking? Desire to sin. Do you want to stand on that platform and meet his death in those flames? That's his only wish. How dare you、uh, sully the purity in his、uh, heart with your wi-、um, wishful thinking? You might be right. It might just be wish-、um, wishful thinking. But if he has been. The faintest desires to live right now. I won't let you take that away from him. I put my hands on my hips,、uh, staring、uh, angrily at Gillis, but saw his gaze darted wildly around, not me and mine. S- suddenly, I found myself remembering how joyful he'd spoken of the days he did wish、uh, he shed with him when he'd、uh, been alive. We had such、uh, fun back then, didn't we? Rushing into battle together, always knowing we had each other's backs. The day, um, the day ran、uh, red with blood, but I was happy. I was happy, Jean, because you were the my side. I know you were troubled by your differences, but I always believed they, um, they were a gift given from um to you from um by God. When you swung your sword in battle, when you prayed for the souls of the dead, you were simply elegantly beautiful. No one in the world was more beautiful than you, and it was a joy and an honor to stand at your side. Uh, look, I have never experienced anything as um ho- um horrific as what you、uh, what you and Jean lived through. I can only imagine what it was like, and I know that's not enough. I know it would be ar- arrogant of me to think of I can、um, ever fully understand what you meant through. But you should、uh, know better than anyone how beautiful Jean、uh, was then he was alive. Gillis said that my um was when I saw a uh, shot a、uh, shot run through him. You were trying to des、um, desperate to rescue Jean from the very moment he was captured. He tried everything he could to save Jean, to rescue him, to bring him home alive and safe, but he failed. And so he、um, mourned and、uh, lamented and blamed himself until his heart was twisted with black with it. The more you loved him, the more、uh, desperate it could、uh, it could make you, and sometimes it、uh, could break you too. You wanted him to live more than anyone else, didn't you? You can't just ki-、uh, go killing him when you care so much about him. You're not just hurting him; you're hurting yourself too. I am. Uh, uh, Nani, of course you are. Shall I? Shall I just try translate? Ah,、uh, let's do it. The pain in your eyes, the sorrow in your eyes, the regret in your eyes. The pain in your eyes, man. Open. I don't know. I can tell from the pain in your eyes just how much you're already hurting.、Uh, I don't know what I was trying to do there. Uh, okay. Gil's、uh, clapped his hands to his head and、uh, clenched into so slightly his knuckles turned twice. Gil's. 
he shook his head to Manly, still grabbing it onto it, uh, at it. His face was in pain and confusion. He began to shake off all over, and then he fumbled um, f- um, uh, for his sword, pulling it free from his shelf. I jumped back quickly, but he didn't seem to even see me anymore. It was as if he was fighting with, with himself. I watched him with white eyes, trying to d- decide whether it was safe to um, turn back on him and run. Purple. Purple. Oh god, is he trying to like kill himself? Okay, um, Kari di Benato wa um ore desu um tano shite uh itakari ba uh saiwa tsu um dame uh ashita oi uh shimasu. Okay. Okay. Um, if you guys don't know what it means, um, it could be. I don't know how accurate it is, but I'm just saying this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoy it, and I'll see you all tomorrow. G- goodbye. Or I could say sayonara. Is that good for you guys? Well, guys. Well. Sayonara, everyone. Sayonara.